And welcome to the SLAS New Product Award press conference. My name is Vicki Luisi and I'm the CEO for SLAS. And we're very, very pleased to be able to welcome you to this new event. Uh, this is something that we've been showcasing throughout the conference and we're very glad you're here. The SLAS International Conference and Exhibition has long been a platform for organizations to introduce innovative new products to the market. And each year we are blown away by what they bring. Life sciences, discovery, and technology professionals come to the conference each year to get a first-hand look at new technologies that will help them increase productivity, elevate data quality, and reduce process cycle times. And this year, just in past years, organizations exhibiting at SLAS 2018 did not disappoint. So let's get things rolling. We're eager to recognize these organizations that are going above and beyond to make an impact in life sciences, discovery, and technology. Please welcome Mary Jo Wildy, the New Product Award Panel Chair, to the podium. Mary Jo. Hi, thanks for coming. Um, I'm speaking for my colleagues. There are eight judges that are part of the panel, and uh, there were 50 applicants uh, this year. They spend about a day and a half uh, reviewing uh, their various criteria that we look at, and uh, there's a lot of, um, as, as you mentioned, a lot of really good new products, new ideas, new things going on. So it's a very difficult uh, discussion. It's very rigorous, and somebody just reminded me that we really invoke the scientific process. So it's about the data, and the future and what it can provide for us to move our, 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 our discovery efforts forward. So with that, with that, uh, I guess we go to the next steps. Thank you very much, Mary Jo, um, for the efforts that your panel put in for um, uh, assessing all of these new products. Um, good evening and welcome. Um, my name is uh, Sibet Verporta and I am the president of SLAS for 2018. The SLAS New Product Award is an annual program recognizing new products that are commercially available for purchase within 90 days pre and post conference that are making a significant impact in empowering the transformation of research that fosters advancement in, in life sciences, drug discovery and development. New products launched by SLAS 2018 exhibitors are rigorously judged by life sciences professionals and up to three are selected each year to receive a new product award. But before we announce the winners, because we have to make it a little um, interesting, right? Um, we'd like to you for you to hear from two past winners of the new product award. Uh, Joe Maffei from Axion Biosystems and Manuela Bailpeter from Analytic Jena will share with you the positive impact the SLAS new product award had on their companies. First, we welcome Joe Maffei. Hi everyone, uh, thanks for the opportunity to speak here today. Thanks for the introduction. Uh, my name is Joe Maffei, I'm an application scientist for Axion. Uh, if you haven't stopped by our booth to say hi, uh, basically what we do is we create MEA devices so that it, scientists can measure the electrical activity from cells like neurons and cardiomyocytes. Uh, we've come to SLAS the last four years. We have a great time here. Um, in 2015, we launched two new products, the first one being Lumos, which is a multi-well light delivery device to increase the throughput of optogenetic studies. The other product that we launched was called Apex. And Apex marries our traditional MEA technology with a robot to fully automate the entire process from cell plating all the way to automated recording. So this was able to take the throughput of MEA to the next level. Um, we were super happy to hear that we won the award, of course. Um, we like to think that we create innovative products but it's another thing to be validated by your peers. So that feels good inside. Um, we also use this, uh, this award to leverage the success of both the Lumos and the Apex. Um, they've both become commercially um, uh, viable products and it lends credibility to our technology to be able to tell our customers that we won this award at a very prestigious conference. 
Uh, we're here again this year with uh, our new line of MEA devices, the Maestro Pro and Edge, which provide uh, even higher amount of sensitivity and ease of use for our users. Um, and we hope that they share the same fate as our previous products that we won awards for here. So thank you very much for the opportunity to speak and congratulations to the soon to be winners. Uh, and I'll leave the podium to the next speaker. Thank you. Thank you. So thank you, Joe. Um, now, please welcome Manuela Bailpeter from Analytic Jena. All right, thank you very much. And um, yeah, thanks to SLRS. And I heard yesterday from uh, the opportunity to talk today and um, share our experience with winning this award. And um, thank also to my previous speaker. I think um, it makes a lot to the heart of the people of a company. When you develop such a product, a new product, a new technology, you never know how this is perceived from the audience, from the customers, and from the scientific uh, community. And then when, you, when we heard last year that we are nominated it already created such a motivation in the team and energy and when we heard we win and we, we are awarded with this this kind of really strove so much energy with the team and we felt so honored and pleased and we are really happy super happy as you said um, with this award we actually could develop this further we introduced the smart technology smart extraction which is a very new technology to extract DNA without magnetic beads without any other technologies and it's a very very um, unique technology and we have our expert, the inventor of the technology on our booth. So if you want to learn more, we are very happy to introduce this to you. And I would like to say congratulations to the new winners. It's a really nice push and award for you in order to bring this technology forward. Thank you. So thank you very much, Manuela. So the moment of truth approaches. This week at SLAS 2018, our judges reviewed 50 new products on the exhibition floor. All of the products reviewed demonstrated innovation and are sure to make a great impact on life sciences discovery. Three of them particularly stood out among the rest. We are pleased to present the three winners of the SLAS 2018 New Product Award. Um, I am pleased to announce Formulatrix as the first of the three winners of the new product award for their innovation, Constellation Digital PCR System. Please welcome Tom Rollins. Hi everyone, um, I'd like to start off by on behalf of Formulatrix, thanking SLAS for this uh, prestigious award. Um, as a company that's built on innovation, we have over 40% of our employees that are engineers um, working to enhance the reproducibility of, um, of science in the scientific community. And we're just so proud of our product development team um, to be able to bring this product to market and really make digital PCR and therefore precise quantification of nucleic acids an accessible technology um, to more researchers. Um, with the Constellation Digital PCR System, we've developed a plate-based approach to digital PCR that allows for a simple workflow that mirrors the workflow of qPCR. It allows for five-color multiplexing, and it also allows for high throughput um, so that applications like gene expression analysis can benefit from the precision of digital PCR. So again, I'd like to thank SLAS for this prestigious award. Um, we're just so honored to uh, have our innovations recognized here at SLAS 2018. Thank you. So thank you, Tom, and congratulations. I am now pleased to announce IOTA Sciences as the second winner of the new product award for their innovation, ISOCELL, um, and please welcome Ed Walsh. Thank you. Um, so I guess we're absolutely delighted to receive the award. We certainly didn't expect it. 
thanks to the judges in particular. It was such fun talking to them, um, giving us one or two of them, giving us very awkward questions. So very enjoyable, though. Um, so I'd like to thank particularly, uh, he's not here, as usual, um, Alex. Oh, he's there. Uh, so I'd like to thank Alex, who is our CSO. You know, he's really driven things. We have a fantastic relationship. And he teaches me biology, I teach him engineering. And I should have said at the start, I'm, I'm a professor of engineering science at Oxford on sabbatical with the company. Um, and Henry Walker then, as our lead chief engineer, he's effectively turned this product around three or four times in the space of a year, effectively redesigning. So to SLAS, um, fantastic show. I thought you know, the products around here are just amazing and just absolutely honored. So delighted with it. So our product, what is our product? So we have developed a way to do isolation of single cells where we can guarantee monoclonal colonies. And we do this at a very cost effective price where we can reach the individual or small lab users. And we do this simply by, we worked very closely, biology and a pathology team from the University of Oxford. And we came up with a way of identifying that the edge effects are the main cause of not achieving clonality at the moment. And they're caused by solid structures of walls and wells. We came up with a way of rather than trying to address this problem, we remove the problem by removing solid walls and replacing them with fluid walls. And therefore, the entire problem is solved. You can very instantly see if you have a single cell or not. Um, I'm going to stop talking. And again, so thanks to everybody. And I appreciate it. Delighted. And then thank you, Ed. And congratulations as well. And now, I am pleased to present the final new product award to LabSite for their innovation Echo 655T Acoustic Liquid Handler. Please welcome Mark Fisher Colbury. Hey, thank you so very much. Uh, we love SLAS because SLAS has a terrific focus on innovation. And acoustic droplet ejection, which was pioneered by LabSite, is quickly become a mainstay and a workhorse of liquid handling across a wide range of application areas. The ability to move liquids with sound with extreme precision and accuracy and in super low volumes that you can aggregate to your choice as to what you want to transfer uh, really is a game changer. And that capability has been further expanded by the ability to think of new workflows and new ways of accomplishing a wide range of tasks. And within that context, uh, this particular project uh, started off in conjunction with AstraZeneca uh, and with others with the ability to develop uh, an acoustic tube formulation that would be very small and tiny uh, that would be enabled with the miniaturization aspect of a 2.5 nanoliter drop transfer coming out of an echo system. And within that context, that is a game changer in terms of storage of compounds in tube containers, uh, enables the ability to go all acoustics uh, within the processes right from scratch from storage, the ability to very quickly, effectively cherry pick samples, put them in a rack, take that rack into an echo system that is now called the 655T, uh, where uh, prior obviously to putting that in, you have to unscrew and decap the caps, good thing to do first. And then uh, have the ability then to have located all the compounds that at will you want to be able to transfer uh, with acoustic dispensing. So uh, in combination with uh, sophisticated uh, software from uh, Titian uh, to help manage that workflow, uh, with Brooks Automation on the storage side, and also co-developing the acoustically friendly tube container, uh, we've uh, completely radically changed uh, how AstraZeneca is doing their entire compound screening uh, processes with a much far, smaller footprint a much faster throughput and a much lower cost. And AZ really kicked off this whole effort and are the leaders on, on this program. So uh, we're very appreciative of the ability to work on this type of innovation 
and to collaborate with a wide range of people. And we very much are honored uh, to have this award. So thank you very much. So thank you very much, uh, Mark, and congratulations again to all three award winners. Um, I hand the podium back to Vicky Luisi. Well, thank you to everyone who submitted a new product for the New Product Award this year, and congratulations to our three winners. Uh, each of the winners will discuss their innovative products with the Lab Man, Dr. Steve Hamilton, in the Lab Man podcast tomorrow at 1030 in the SLAS booth, and you can hear more about their products then. Uh, we will not be having a formal Q&A here today, but we do encourage you to stick around and talk with the winners about their products and visit each of them in their booths. You can find Formula Formulatrix in booth 1335. IOTA Sciences can be found in booth 1829, right over there in Innovation Avenue. And LabSite can be found in booths 915 and 921. And as you can see, there's a reception going on in the exhibit hall. So we invite you to stay and enjoy it. Uh, visit the posters. There is a poster session going on right now as well. And by all means, visit with the exhibitors and hang around for a while. Thank you very much.